Bonsai Dream. Dream. Bonsai Dream. This is a hawk I style today with Mauro uh, here at the Intensive 2021 and uh, come and join us because you will have to work on a beautiful trees on your trees and you will learn a lot much a lot so come join us next year Italian Bonsai Dream on the Intensive School. Uh, today we have been working on this uh, Chinese elm. Uh, first we took off um, defoliated the whole tree and then we wired it and we placed all the branches. Hi, I'm Matteo. Uh, later on we set uh, the wire and we put every branches in position and restyled the whole tree. 
So you see, we have this movement, and now we have this movement. Probably this one will be a little bit more towards outside. The other thing. So my name is Benoit and uh, we have been very happy to work on this tree. We have been there for dating it totally and wired it as uh, to make a new shape and to resize it totally. And uh, yeah, it was a very interesting work. We had to take off a lot of a lot of dead wood that was that was totally rotten and uh, now it has a really clean uh, clean shape. We uh, sorted out some, uh, some branches to keep and uh, uh, this was a great exercise really to, to improve not only the wiring skills but to, to, to give a three-dimensional shape into, into, into the tree that doesn't look flat and uh, that it looks uh, like a nature, like an old tree in nature which, which has suffered or which is windblown, which has, uh, which has its character. Why you decide to come at the intensive this year? Well, that was to uh, to improve uh, the overall skills and um, get us well in contact with the uh, with the bonsai community, which is a great great way to share a, a passion for this beautiful art and uh, and do something for the couple. Too. Yes, yes, exactly, exactly. Good. I love to see you working together. That was a great uh, also experience for me to see you working together and help each other. It's still is very interesting. Thank you. Hi, my name is. George and I'm from Austria and we did this taxos for the last two days. We just bended the branches down and uh, wired everything and now we are finished with the second styling and from now on the, the tree can grow just as it wants more or less and then in maybe next or next year or in two years we will finalize the styling. Ciao a tutti, sono Marco, sono qui da Mauro Stenberger per l'intensive. Questo è il risultato finale dopo due anni di lavoro. Ora abbiamo cominciato nell'intensive del 2019. E il lavoro che abbiamo effettuato è stato quello di la prima rifinitura e soprattutto di pieghe molto forti di quasi tutta la ramificazione, però abbiamo creato anche dei grandi gin nelle parti basse de, del bonsai. E, mh, questo è il risultato finale dopo due anni di, di coltivazione. Ciao a tutti, sono Enrico. Oggi abbiamo lavorato su questo Gine Pro Kishu eh, per dare una rifinitura ai palchi. Abbiamo portato appunto questo palco in questa posizione in modo da dare una, maggiore, eh, una migliore silhouette alla pianta. Tutti i palchi sono stati ripuliti e ridefiniti in modo tale da dare più luce e anche da mh, permettere alla pianta di essere portata in mostra. Hello, my name is Ireno, I am from Treviso, Italy, and this is uh, the plant uh, we work today with uh, Mauro. This is a uh, Shimpaku, Itoigawa, and this is the second uh, year I work uh, this uh, uh, plant uh, with uh, this tree with uh, Mauro. Today we restyled a little bit, we um, uh, improve the detail of the branch, and uh, in spring we report in this. Uh, training pot and maybe in next spring we give to this tree a nice bonsai pot. Thank you. Hello guys, I am René from Germany and today we worked on this beautiful Sabina juniper. Um, yesterday we talked about the new position and branch setting because we thought this uh, tree had, had much, much more uh, power and uh, we want to create more of the positive uh, um, trunk line to see so we changed the angle a little, a little bit and then uh, we wired the tree uh, completely and after the setting of the branches in the new positions and the new angle 
the tree is for us much more in balance. We see more of the powerful gins and the loops of the yin and shari from the trunk. So we think it's a very good result for the tree in only one day or around seven hours. So I hope you enjoy it and like it too. Hey, my name is Rudy. I'm here at the uh, intensive at Mauro uh, 2021. And today we worked at this uh, Swedish pine. Uh, it was a raw material, basically, three years in the pot now. And we tried to find a good solution. So uh, we basically turned the uh, tree around in the front side um, and made this uh, bunjin out of it. Uh, and I think it's a good solution. Um, it's the first uh, development or the first uh, design, basically, and uh, we will really keep on working the next years. Hi, my name is Abdiel, and today I'm joined with Christopher. Uh, we worked on this beautiful Sabina Juniper. Uh, we refined all the pads and did a little bit of shari in the life vein. Mostly I did this section of the tree and Christopher did most of the upper pads of the plant. Hola, mi nombre es Christopher Zambolin. Estoy aquí en el Intensive 2021 con Mauro y estuvimos haciendo un trabajo de refinado en esta hermosa sabina. Eh, básicamente lo que yo estuve haciendo fue creando las líneas y refinando los pads para poder entonces dar ese look eh, visible de los pads con ayuda del maestro. Ciao a tutti, sono Paolo. Oggi siamo qua all'intensive da Mauro Stenberg. Abbiamo iniziato a lavorare questo melograno e abbiamo dato la primo, una prima impostazione e consiglio a tutti di portare i vostri materiali per dare un primo styling e cominciare una, un nuovo lavoro sulle vostre piante. Hello, I'm Eloy, I'm uh, from Norway. I'm here attending the intensive school at uh, Mauro Stamberger. Uh, today we style this uh, Carpinus orientalis. We first start to clean it and then we buy the whole thing and then we put out the branches and style it to make it uh, look like clouds. Start from the bottom and then we continue up all the way to the right backs. How was your experience uh, at uh, the intensive now that the intensive is finished? It was a fantastic time. I learned more in these 10 days that I've done in uh, the four years I've actually been doing bonsai. Uh, I learned my skills on the biting is much better now. Uh, my overall view of how to see the tree, both uh, deciduous trees and conifers. Um, I think my skills are much better now. So thank you, Mauro. Very good. Andrea? Buongiorno a tutti, sono Andrea. Io invece vengo dall'Italia e come diceva prima Roy, già da ieri abbiamo iniziato a sistemare, pulire e filare tutta questa meravigliosa pianta. L'abbiamo filata e inoltre abbiamo aggiunto questi tiranti per poter permettere a questi rami superiori di venire a, di poter coprire meglio questo la parte centrale che altrimenti sarebbe stata abbastanza spoglia e abbastanza vuota, quindi così dà un'impressione di maggiore uniformità nell'insieme. Andrea, dove hai visto le informazioni per venire al mio intensi? Le informazioni le, eh, le ho prese da uno degli ultimi video, in particolare quello sull'Olmo e da lì ho... Quindi dal mio canale di YouTube, canale perfetto. YouTube. Grazie per seguire il mio canale di YouTube e grazie, grazie per essere venuto. Grazie a te. So this is Benoit and I'm, uh, I'm Philip. We are working here in the intensive course uh, with Mauro Stemberger. We're working on this, on this beautiful elm here, which uh, started out really as a, as a stump, which looked like uh, almost nothing. And uh, it was a lot of work to, uh, to bring it to the state. There was uh, uh, a lot of carving done. We hollowed out the whole trunk. We started at the top and uh, made this opening here. Maybe it was inspired by a kind of a secret that lies inside this tree or that has, uh, that has something to attract the eye of the, of the, of the spectator that, uh, that, that catches some attention. So um, the next steps, maybe Ben Watt uh, can, can uh, explain. After the carving, 
After the carving, we, wi we wired everything. And, um, and after we brought it the tree, that was in a, in a small box. And finally, yeah, we protect all the, all the borders, of course, as we did a lot of craving everywhere. And, and we started it. Beautiful. Good job, guys. è una pianta che ho acquistato tre anni fa di importazione dal Giappone e diciamo che fino ad oggi eh, sono state fatte solo le concimazioni e quest'anno qui da Mauro l'abbiamo totalmente lavorata e abbiamo, pulito, è stata, abbiamo pulito totalmente le, le linee è stata filata totalmente e abbiamo impostato tutta la struttura della pianta Abbiamo scelto anche il fronte, gli step successivi saranno il rinvaso in primavera e alleggerire, tagliare le, le, le linee forti e continuare con la concimazione. Intensive uh, 2021. Uh, I'm here with this beautiful Korean hornbeam. We just defoliated it and uh, uh, set the wire and made the second style. We had the first style last year, uh, in which we put uh, in place the primary ramification. So uh, now we start uh, the refinement work. Enjoy. Bonsai Dream! Come and join us. Bonsai Dream. Bonsai Dream. Bonsai Dream. 